Robert from Conroe has a major remodel. He sure does. He's making significant structural changes to his home, Tom. Mm. Robert writes, I'm looking to get uh, get a beam to put to open up the floor plan, removing a load-bearing wall in my house. Okay? Kind of like we did here in our studio. We, we almost just sit look right up. under it. It's right. You can't <laughs> you see, can it, but see it. We can, and believe me, we check it when we walk <laughs> under it. It's anyway, nice. he says, "Where do I go?" He says, "To find a structural engineer." And here are the plans, by the way. Let me just show you all, so you know what he's talking about. This is what he has right now. Yes. And, and you know, right there, where it says porch. Okay. Note that wall when we go to the second one. Bam, wall mm -hmm. gone. And he wants to instead put this beam across here. Yeah, he's got a center support on that, so it's not going to be a big deal. That can be designed at the could lumber you, yard. Could you do that as an open span all the way across, you think? You can do anything you want, Charlie. Just get out your checkbook. <laughs> you might could write a book. You might have to use a, flight, a flitch plate, which would be steel between uh, different pieces of lumber. Plate. Yes. Can you say that at Mixed Company? <laughs> yeah, I just did. <laughs> <laughs> Chris is here. <laughs> anyway, it can be designed. That's a simple one. It, it seems more difficult than it is with that center support. You actually have two beams, not one, even though it could be one long one. Or they might give you two. With that center support, they can splice the support right on top of that. And that's easier to handle for the guys. But uh, no problem. That'll be easily done. And you don't need a structural engineer. Uh, they'll do it at the lumber yard. Okay. You give them the specs. They pump it in their uh, computer. And it's all designed on the computer. That's that's. That blows my mind because, I mean, there was a time when that was not how it was done. Well, you had to punch numbers. You had to get the slide rule out and things like that. Slide rule. <laughs> slide. Remember slide rules? I still have mine. Are you old enough to remember slide rules? We went to the moon almost with them. We Actually, sure we did. did. We did. We went oh, to the I'm moon sorry. with slide rules. What's yeah. wrong with me? I remember <laughs> when I was in high school back at, I remember when Mr. Swenson in high school uh, at White Mounds Regional High School in Whitefield, New Hampshire, told my class, you're going to be the last class we teach how to use slide rules. It's true. Which just made us feel even better for learning something that he was admittedly telling us at the beginning of the year was going to be obsolete by the time we graduated. I was awesome. In the, <laughs> I was in the last class that learned how to do architecture with a pen and a T-square. And they told us, from now on, it's going to be all computers. And I'm going, and I'm getting graded on this. I'm getting graded yes. Really? That's exactly what I said. Boy, that was <laughs> worth my million dollars. <laughs> all right. So the good news is, Robert, you, don't need, a, radio. you don't need a structure. <laughs> engineer, right? Just or a radio to, talk show host. You go to any lumber yard or, or a yeah, any lumber, lumber, any good lumber okay. yard will be able to take back care of that. Robert here. Okay. Yes. Good. All right. And back to you. You're looking for more help. We can get you more. God knows we need it. Um. Before we go any more. The Home Depots and Lowe's are not lumber yards, so just put that oh, out there. Okay. Yeah, we're not talking home center. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Lumber yard. Yeah, they're talking the other day about how uh, on CNBC uh, they're talking about how well Home Depots where the contractors go. I'm like, really? I never did. Maybe the one truck Chuck contractors. Uh, yeah, the contractors that I like, I was. I was on the phone. Hey, I need this, this, and this, and then next they thing a truck shows up. That's right. That's that, that's a lumber yard. <laughs> yes. All right. all right, and that's about all we got here. You want, want some more? Look for. Uh, videos like this we post a new one every day at homeshowradio.com